It's a hot day in Northern California. Our search for the secret of muffling the sound of engine exhaust has brought us to West Sacramento. That's because this is home to the Flowmaster factory. Flowmaster has been designing exhaust mufflers since 1983 and now has 250 workers at two sites, totaling over 1.3 million square feet. They operate the only research and development facility of its kind anywhere in the world, and the team is dedicated to turning the wild scream of an untreated engine exhaust into the kind of mechanical purr beloved by motorheads around the world. The sound of a nicely tuned engine is something I enjoy immensely. In order to design the perfect muffler, you first need to sound out your enemies, in this case, the engine and its exhaust system. Every combination is different, which means every car has its own unique sound. To analyze that sound, engineers like Kevin Hand use a device called a dynamometer to make a kind of audio fingerprint of the engine system. We're looking for the bad guys, the bad frequencies, the ones that really annoy you when you're driving your car. High frequency is like fingers across a chalkboard. Low frequencies are pleasing and pleasant sounds. The first battle in the war on noise is to reduce the pressure inside the exhaust. This is done by creating a large box from sheets of steel, which is cut to size and then molded with a hydraulic press. The shape of this section creates low pressure as the exhaust gas enters it, dissipating some of its energy and thus reducing noise. But the really clever part is the way the muffler tunes the engine sound using resonance chambers. These rely on the principle of sound cancellation. The idea is to cause certain irritating frequencies to resonate or echo. In theory, by making the lows of the echoes coincide with the peaks of the irritating sound, the two should simply cancel one another out. If the sections are welded even the tiniest fraction of an inch out of line, the chambers won't work and could even make the problem worse. The only way to build this section is with the aid of a friendly robot. Having a robot as my work partner is a wonderful thing. I never have to worry about them talking to me. Swinging back and forth all day, this thing never gets bored, never makes a mistake, and produces a perfect weld every time. In the past, these fancy sound-reducing tricks have come at a price in terms of raw engine performance. Pushing and twisting the exhaust through a number of chambers causes back pressure, forcing the engine to work harder. Thanks to Flowmaster's ingenious straight-line system, the engine exhaust is actively drawn out of the engine, meaning the muffler actually improves overall performance. All of which means that whether you're a kid in a souped up hot rod, a race car driver going full speed, or simply taking a gentle spin on a Sunday afternoon, you can do it knowing that when the engine is running to the max, you won't wind up with perforated eardrums. So let's hear it for the muffler.